All right, guys. So this is uh, just a quick, I guess, what happens when you crossfire two different uh, Radeon graphics cards? Uh, well, I guess just to brush over things real quick. This is this is my computer. This is a uh, Cooler Master HAF high airflow box, and it's on its side right now, as you can see. But, uh, at any rate, what I have in here, amongst other things, um, Corsair liquid cooling. It's got like, I think, 8 gigs of RAM, which is plenty for me. Uh, a Dynex uh, card reader. Two DVD rewritable drives. Uh... An Asus motherboard, 800 watt power supply. It's an Intel i5, I believe, um, processor. And then now to the graphics cards. So what I've done here is I have a Radeon 6770, which is actually the smaller one here. Well, it's really close. Okay, sorry. And then a Radeon 5770. Which are cross fireable, I guess you could say, for the lack of a better way to say it. So, the 5770 is actually the bigger one. The 6770 is the smaller one. Just went to a uh, computer store, picked up a generic, it's not a name brand, uh, external bridge here. Really easy to install. Really self explanatory. And it does work. Um, the one problem I do notice, and I do hope this helps everyone, uh, or at least some people, is that the the reason that they really upgraded these two graphics cards are almost exactly the same the upgrade is that it's quieter it's smaller um, it is a little bit better uh, but aside from that it, it's basically the same thing but with cross firing the two of these the louder and older version the 5770 actually kicks its fan into like maximum overdrive and thus making any time that the computer is on very very loud so you know it's it's good uh, it's it's better graphics it's more uh, I guess you could say smooth gaming or whatever you may be doing um, but as far as you know do you want to save the money to buy two of these or Honestly, if I, for what I do, I play Skyrim amongst many other things. If I just were to have the 6770, it'd be perfectly fine. I wouldn't need both. I put in both just to uh, show you guys, you know, what it would look like. It's it's not terrible. I mean, I, it looks like someone threw a bowl of spaghetti in here with all this crap. Uh, what I'm doing, actually, is I'm building this computer up. Next is more RAM, uh, new motherboard, and an i7 processor. Um, I'm going to put in, it's got three hard drives now, one of them solid state. I'm going to put in two more hard drives and three more disk drives, and then I'm basically going to sell the computer. Um, if you're interested, please let me know. If you want anything put in, specific, spec, well, specifically for you, please let me know. Um, and then up here, I am either going to put in a dormant and not hooked up power supply so you guys can toy around with it or something of the nature. So once again, cross fireable, yes, uh, as long as it's not like a 6770 and like a 5780. So that those last two numbers there, they have to be in the same class in other words. It is doable. Is it worth it? Honestly what I would do, I would have saved my money and bought a second 6770. Or a, what is it, uh, uh, 8770 or whatever whatever actually is uh, is now out but this is what I have I hope this helps you comment rate reply uh, please tell me what you think any ideas for future videos let me know thanks YouTube